Installing the tools on Windows can be done in a variety of ways. We will go through the simplest way, which is to use a package manager called Chocolaty. A package manager is a command line tool that automates the whole installation process, much like apt-get for Linux or brew for Mac. To install the package manager, you just need to visit chocolaty.org, then click on install menu, then click on install chocolaty, and under install with cmd, just copy the command and paste it in a new command line window. And of course, make sure to run the command as an administrator. Now you just wait for the installation to complete. To install a package, you type in choco install package name, like git for example. And you of course accept any confirmation messages you get along the way. Again, make sure you always install from an administrator CMD. In this course, we will be using PHP to create the server, Arduino IDE to write the Arduino code, Python to create the controller, Android Studio to create the Android app, and brackets to write both the server and the controller codes. So let's install them all. Start an administrator CMD and install Python by typing choco install Python. Once done, just open up another CMD window and see if it works. And it does. Now back to the admin CMD, install the brackets and test it as well. So I'll create a new folder for the server project and create a hello world PHP example. Now let's install PHP the same way. And once done, Open up another CMD and navigate to the hello world example and launch the PHP server there. You do that by typing PHP space dash S space 0 0.0.0.0, .0 colon 80. This basically tells the server to accept requests from all possible IP addresses. Now fire up your browser and type in localhost and boom, there is it, your hello world example. Now get back to the admin CMD and install Arduino IDE. Now, sometimes the package manager does not add the installed tool to the environment variables. So when I type in Arduino, it can't locate it. In that case, we just open up the environment variables. So under this PC, you click properties, then advanced system settings, then environment variables, then under systems, edit the path. Now you just copy the location where Arduino is installed and you paste it as a new environment path and save it and quit. Now, as you can see, now you can launch Arduino IDE from the command line as well. And of course, you can test the Blinken program to ensure that the installation went well by uploading the Blink example to the Arduino. Now, the final thing you might want to install is Android Studio. To do that, you can just type in choco install Android Studio as well. Now, once everything is set up, you will have the right environment to start building the project. 